Hey everyone, Daniel here from Twin Bytes with another quick tutorial for you. This time on how to change your Windows 10 lock screen background picture from the default Windows Spotlight to anything you want. The first thing you'll want to do is download a picture. So you can probably just go on to Google and search for maybe a vacation spot you'd like to go to and then select images so it'll show you only the pictures the next thing is making sure it's in a high resolution so if you go to tools and then over here to size you can choose large so this way it's going to be a high quality photo and you can just look through the ones that are here and maybe uh, pick something from here and you'll be able to see the uh, resolution here possibly uh, on this. Uh, when you hover the mouse over it shows the screen resolution. If you right click on it you can go to save the image. Once you have the image saved you can uh, go into open and edit it if you want. So you could take that photo as it is and use that as your wallpaper or if you wanted to you can use any picture editor that you want to add some graphics and details to it so you can uh, go in here make adjustments crop it and so on you can go into edit it uh, with 3d paint for example and you can add in some text and just start typing in if you can actually read the text and add something in here but anyway this is uh, just an example of uh, what you can do and you'd be able to save that uh, as that the next thing you want to do now that you have a picture to replace your default with is go into the start menu under settings and we want to go to personalization and then you'll see the first thing is highlighting your background so you could change the background as well in here and uh, you can just pick any picture you want we want to go into lock screen and by default it's on Windows Spotlight so it's showing randomly generated pictures that get updated on a regular basis so if you don't want that and you want a static picture you can go in here to choose picture and then it shows the last few pictures you may have had in here or you can hit browse and we browse for our photo that we did download and choose that and now we can see we got that picture as our background with the uh, edit that we made as well so that's basically all there is to it to changing the lock screen it does remember down here the last ones that you had so you can actually uh, click on any one of these to choose the ones that uh, you'd want to go back to or browse and pick something else completely different from your computer for a quick tip when you're browsing photos and you see something you, you like you could right click on any one of these and go to set as desktop background that will only change it as your desktop wallpaper it doesn't change the lock screen so if you want it to change the lock screen as well you would have to save the image first and then go in through the process that I just showed you so that's it for this super quick tutorial I hope you found it helpful do give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and let me know what other video tutorials you guys might be looking for all right thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one bye for now